Right, well, here's a query everybody always asks me about porcelain on exactly how strong it actually is. So I think we'll do a little test. We're gonna drop some stuff at, say, waist height, something like that. Drop it on the floor, see how actually tough these tiles are. And it'll also answer a couple of questions for myself too. Here we go then. People always ask about this. So let's try, let's see. So in the garden, you're always gonna have pots and stuff, plants. So let's see what happens when I drop it. Makes a mess for sure. And absolutely nothing wrong with the tile. So let's step her up a bit. Let's go for a sledgehammer. I think that's a good enough height. So as you can see, no damage at all. Right, let's try a brick. Bricks dropped on it. Craft made a mess. Nothing wrong with it at all. So this is slightly more to the extreme. Concrete block. A concrete block's definitely got some strength. So let's try it. Oh. Not a problem, not a problem. Actually, maybe a little bit of a fracture but there, but quite minimal. So we'll finish it off with a lump hammer. Nope, seems to be fine. Well, maybe a little bit of tile came off. But um, any questions on how strong porcelain tiles are? Hopefully that's... Uh, I sorted it out for you, but I'm quite happy. All right, okay. So, well, we do have to break the first tile up to be able to get underneath it to actually start ripping everything up. So yeah, let's try it with this hammer. This is a Thor hammer, I call it. Yeah, I did get a crack there. I did get a crack there. Yeah. So if you're actually purposely hitting it with a big hammer then it obviously is going to break for um, dropping things on it you should actually be fine but yeah don't literally grab it because everything will definitely break so we'll pull this up now and um, we'll get cracking